From all of us at Positive Christianity, I want to wish you a very, very happy new year. And from my family to your family, I pray that 2014 is a special time. And I pray that it's a special time in a special way for you that you're able to let go of the past. Don't waste today's time cluttering up tomorrow's opportunity with yesterday's troubles. In Matthew 5, 21 and 22, the Bible says, you're familiar with the command to the ancients, do not murder. Well, I'm telling you that anyone who is as much as angry with a brother or sister is guilty of murder. See, murder happens first up here. And we literally kill precious opportunities when we think in the wrong way. It is better to go into this new year and every new day with a clean slate where nothing from the past that robs us and kills the present moment is brought along for the ride. Do you invest more time than you should? reliving the past, or even dreaming of revenge. You'd be surprised to hear what I hear about the people that want that day, are longing for that day when they can have revenge. That is murdering. And who's it murdering? It's murdering you. It's taking away your peace, your joy. Are you troubled by feelings inside of you of anger, bitterness, or even regret? If so, it is time as we approach this new year to let go of these feelings. And it's time to get serious about putting the past where it belongs in its proper place, which is past behind you. Perhaps there's something in your past that you deeply regret. Or maybe you've been scarred by a trauma that you seemingly cannot get over. Well, why not make today the day to ask for God's help to sincerely and in a prayerful way determine once and for all to move beyond yesterday's pain so that you can fully savor and, and open the opportunities that 2014 has for you. Now, of course, it's natural to want to lick wounds and the, try to heal the injustices that you've suffered and to hold grudges against the people who inflicted them. But God, God has a better plan. God wants you to live in the present. See, any time that we live in yesterday, we're still giving them the power. The people that might have done an injustice to us, we're giving them our power. We're murdering ourselves in this day, and we're murdering the opportunities that we have in the future. God knows that you're going to be happier and healthier than even you do. God knows your future. God has already prepared it for those that are aware and can accept. Can you? I hope you do. It is my prayer for you. And I pray also with you that 2014 is the greatest year yet of your life. Happy New Year.